A quarter of girls and nearly one in ten boys show signs of depression at the age of 14, say UK researchers. The findings come from more than 10,000 young people who shared their worries and emotions. Surveys with their parents, however, suggested many were not attuned to the true anxieties of their teenage sons and daughters. Parents often underestimated daughters' stress and had concerns about sons that the boys themselves did not voice. Lead investigator Dr. Pravitha Padale from Liverpool University said teenagers, and particularly girls, were facing more mental health difficulties than previous generations. Many factors could be contributing, including exam stress and worries about body image, experts believe. Half of all cases of adult mental illness start by the age of 14, and it is important they are diagnosed and treated early. Demand for specialist services is growing, but child and adolescent mental health teams are overstretched and turn away nearly a quarter of the young patients referred to them, says the National Children's Bureau, which has published the survey findings. Its chief executive, Anna Fuch Lang, said, with a quarter of 14-year-old girls showing signs of depression, it's now beyond doubt that this problem is reaching crisis point. Worryingly, there is evidence that parents may be underestimating their daughter's mental health needs. Conversely, parents may be picking up on symptoms in their sons, which boys don't report themselves. It's vital that both children and their parents can make their voices heard to maximize the chances of early identification and access to specialist support. Dr. Mark Bush, from the charity Young Minds, said, We know that teenage girls face a huge range of pressures, including stress at school, body image issues, bullying and the pressure created by social media. Difficult experiences in childhood, including bereavement, domestic violence or neglect, can also have a serious impact, often several years down the line. To make matters worse, it can be extremely difficult for teenagers to get the right support if they're struggling to cope. That's why it's crucial that mental health services are properly funded with a focus on early intervention.